guys, Karen here with another video and Happy New Year to all of those. If this is your first time watching me, I want to say thank you guys for tuning in. Um, if you're a first time to our channel, please uh, hit the subscribe button. That would be great. Oh, I'm getting used to saying that. Okay, okay. Anyway, so this video idea comes from a subscriber who sent it in, I believe, last month or November when I was asking for ideas. Um, and I thought this would be really fun, so I decided to save it for the new year um, so we could do this together. So my hope is um, that we'll all in the comments below, if you want to, you don't have to, but I would love it if we could all guess, um, give our own predictions of what we think um, the color will be um, for this spring or you know late winter early spring. Last year we know that in January the color agave was introduced beautiful rich tone um, blue color um, and then it was followed by cool mint and then we had cayenne and then there was az um, azure and we ended the, the year with chambray. Yeah, so I don't know how many of you got a chance to take advantage of some of those colors, but what I noticed during the year, especially for the blue um, colors, they started off the year with in that blue family, and it was a rich, deep, beautiful color, um, and then ended the year with a kind of denim sort of denim jean co color blue. So that was kind of fun. So I am not expecting blue this year. Does that make sense? Does that make sense? I'm hoping that makes sense. So then they also did a take on the uh, cayenne, which to me was like a fusion of the cerise and the flame color together which made like an incredible um, color when you saw it in person. Although for me, it was a little bit too close. Well, it was just kind of right there in between. And um, for me, I either preferred the Cerise or the Flame, but the Cayenne was, albeit beautiful, it was just uh, too much of a mixture for me. Still beautiful though. Um, so, so we know that Le Creuset uh, um, does a, at least one new colorway, introduces one new color per year. Um, and so they haven't done it yet. So that was kind of exciting. I was like, yay, they're waiting for my video. Not really, I'm just saying. Um, by the way, if this is your first time uh, tuning into our channel, please feel free to become part of our family. And just hit the subscribe button there. That would be great. But anyway, I am hoping that... Um, so the fun part of this would be for everyone to drop in the comments below what two um, colors you think that um, they're going to come from this year, or not just this year, just spring. We're just going to stick to spring because thinking of the entire year, that's too far in advance. But okay, but just dealing with late winter, early spring, we can do that. We can do that. That's not too much pressure. So with that being said, I have my notes down here. You know, I always have my notes. So like I said, we had, they started with agave last year, cool mint, cayenne, azure, and then chambray. Am I missing any colors in there? I know there were some colors sprinkled there in, um, that were probably part of like, um, partnerships. Um, but other than that, I think I've included all of them. So like I said before, I'm not thinking blue is going to be a thing this year. I'm thinking they did blue last year. What I'm hoping for, which I'm hesitant to say, but I'm going to say it. Um, and by the way, you don't have to say, um, like the, like, I'm just saying like, come, which palette do you think is coming from? Like the greens or is it coming from the red, um, whatnot. But I really do think that we might see a lighter color green. I, you know, maybe I'm thinking that, or maybe I'm just hoping that rosemary might come back. Um, 
I'm just putting it out there. Rosemary, um, beautiful color, beautiful green. Um, there was a little bit of, um, you know, tempting with that at Christmas time when we had that emerald green color. Um, just a beautiful green. It, the pot just was too big for me, but beautiful green color. So I'm thinking maybe that was a hint of what we might see in spring. And I think that will be a, a excellent color for the ending of winter and early spring. So I'm going, so my first pick would be rosemary around that green palette. Just um, the different, the softer greens and the lighter greens, not so much um, the artichoke. That was a deeper, darker green. I, I'm thinking more of um, similar to the, not necessarily the emerald green, but um, uh, a really bright kind of, um, light uh, rosemary green. So that's my first pick. I'm going with the green family, green, and hopefully it's around the rosemary color. That's my first one. And then my second one is something we haven't seen in, um, I don't think it's two years now. I think, so I don't think it's going to be a purple because we still have fig out there and they still have um, the Provence available um, in the mug but what they haven't had in a little bit was a pink color am I alone in thinking this um, so I'm thinking around like um, the hibiscus color um, even a hot pink would be good not so much red but like a hot um, pink color somewhere around there um, am I wrong am I, I do you think I'm going in the right direction here? Does anybody agree? Just drop it in the comments below. I'm serious because I'm really think I really sit there and think about these things. <laughs> so, um, but yeah, so my pick, I have two. So I'm in the comments, leave two. Or if, you know, if you're, you know, if you want to leave two, you can. If you just want to leave one, that's fine too. But I'm gonna leave two. I'm going to say, um, I'm going to say it might be from the greens, green family, and the pink. Because we haven't seen those two in a while, other than the artichoke. And I'm thinking maybe at Christmas time, that emerald was just a little tantalizing taste of what we might see uh, late winter, early spring. So, like I said, I'm not going to keep you long in this video. I'm just putting it out there. Um, I thought it would be fun so we could uh, share in this together. Like I said, I don't want to be right or wrong by myself. So let's see what we get up to in this video. Let's see what colors we come up with. I want to see what you guys are thinking in the comments below. And, and yeah, so um, please like, comment, and subscribe. Definitely comment because I'm really interested to know what colors do you, you know you guys are thinking of and maybe then that'll like kind of change my mind maybe there's some yellow because we haven't seen a yellow other than nectar for a little while too but i'm getting ahead of myself i'm really thinking anyway <laughs> i will see you guys in the next video and you guys um have a great day everyone